Welcome to Soma Academy. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a drop down list in Microsoft Excel. Uh, on the screen, you can see that uh, I have names of players and their positions. Uh, this column, column E, the data on column E I have typed, but in, in the next column, column F, I have, I want to create a drop down list. Rather than typing, I want to choose a drop down list. So in order to do that, the first step is you choose from the menu at the top, you choose data. And then you also select the column where you want to have the drop down list. Uh, from there, you choose a data validation. You click on data validation. And once you do that under the data validation criteria, you click on the, that drop down and then choose list. From there on, what you can do is you can type your options here. For example, the first one on the list is a goalkeeper. And then you separate that by comma. Next, I have a defender. Then the next thing I have on the list is a midfielder. Also forward. So those are the four categories of this drop down list. Then I click okay if you look at on the drop down list there is that triangle icon that you have so and when you click on that you all have and on every cell of that column you have that drop down list for example the first one is a goalkeeper so i can just select the next one is a forward so i select uh, the next one is also a forward next one is a midfielder the next one is a forward uh, the next one is a midfielder so now I'm just selecting them rather than typing I'll just select them from the drop-down list defender no sorry that's a midfielder uh, and then a defender midfielder and then next one is a goalkeeper so that is how you create a drop down list. Just to recap, first step, you select the column where you want to have the drop down list to appear. Next step, you choose you from the top menu, you click data and then from there you click on data validation. And then in the data validation criteria, you have to make sure that you have list as the category. So by by default you will have any value but you have to choose select uh you have to select list and then from there on you 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 type your 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 options goalkeeper defender and make sure you separate that by commas and then you click okay and from there on you just have to fill in each cell with the options that you want i hope this was helpful i will stop it there for today Please do not forget to subscribe. Until then, happy learning.